Hello friends, I'm Parways and this is our 23rd video in Gcanter GUI application development. In the previous video, we have learned how you can uh, add legends to your matplotlib graph in Gcanter window, and this is from the previous video. In this video, I'm going to show you uh, how you can uh, uh, how you can work with dialogues in Gcanter. So I have made a new file at the name of uh, uh, let me close this and close out. Terminate. Okay. Now I have made a new file, Python file, at of Gcanter dialog widget. I'm going to copy just my window code and paste it in here, and just change the title to Gcanter uh, dialog widget like this. Okay. Now if I run this, you can see I have a nice window. After this. Uh, First, I need some imports. Uh, the first one from Tkinter, uh, import uh, TTK. Also from Tkinter, I'm going to import file dialog. The first thing I need, I'm going to create a label frame in here. Uh, self dot label uh, frame. TTK dot label frame. It needs some parameters, the cell and also the text is uh, open a file. Okay, now I'm going to grade this cell.labelframe.grade and in column 0 and row 0, row 1, give a padding of x to 20, also give a padding y to 20. Okay, now uh, this is our label frame and also now I'm going to create a new button in here uh, the button cell dot button uh, ttk dot button I want this button should be in the label frame also give a text to this uh, browse a file and now create this so dot button dot great I need this button it should be in column one and row one and let me uh, call my button in here my button function in here and let me check this okay now I have a nice uh, browser file wind uh, window if I click on this uh, there's no functionality for this button and uh, now I'm going to add this functionality to my uh, this button. Uh, now we are going to create another method in here at uh, name of the file dialog. And in the file dialog, first I'm going to create a variable self dot file name and take your file dialog dot ask open file name. It needs some parameters. The first one is the uh, Initial uh, directory, initial dir, I give it by default. Also, it needs a title to uh, select a file. Also, it needs a file type. A file type. Like this, okay? And the file type is. Uh, Now I'm going to give the file type, uh, the file type I give it JPEG and uh, star.jpg. Uh, now we need also one more for our all, all files and this is star.star. .star. Okay. Uh, now let me just uh, check this that it's working or not. I'm going to add a comment in here and call my file dialog uh, method in here. Let me run this. Okay, now we have window. If I click on open a file, I'm getting an error. I think uh, must be. Uh, comment 
indicated bad option. Um, let me check this bit. What is wrong? Oh yeah, I have forgot to add an L in here. Now let me run this. And if I click on open browser file, you can see now it is in local C by default. Now I'm going to add some more functionality for my this simple application. Uh, for this, uh, I'm going to create a label, uh, self dot label, uh, ttk dot label, and uh, I want this label should be in label frame, and the text is empty. Now grade this label, uh, label dot grade, and it should be in column one and row two. Now configure this label dot configure for setting our text, and the text is a uh, dot file name. Now let me run this and check my application. If I browse open a file, now I'm going to, uh, for example, choose this. And if I click on OK, you can see now the file path is in my label frame. Uh, thank you guys. If you have any question, please let me know. And for the further videos, don't forget subscription of my channel.